wonder if they'll have Toy Story Land merch. Huh? Oh, okay. Hey, uh, your head's getting in my way. Oh my god, mom, this is the Done. <laughs> <laughs> I have 50 bucks. It's not $30. Then I want toys. The tree of life. I have $50. I can get a bag. Or I could just. Probably would. I don't think so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Seven dollars. Whoa there. Five dollars. That. Long story short, I have twenty-one dollars, and I'm just gonna find Oswald stuff or something I want if I can't find Oswald. They have May the Fourth be with you from 2018 shirts, like Star Wars Day. I'm into that nerd stuff. How much is it? Never mind. I said never mind. This is ten bucks. But I can't find Jennifer. I go over in for more Oswald. Peggy McQueen. Ooh. Nope. There we go. Here's one. What even? What is that? I couldn't even see what that one was. Another one. How much is it? Eight bucks. I'm not sure. I also got this. I saw that one. How you already seen it? Okay. Cause you look peanuts. I know, but but this is savage. 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 Yes. But my giant stiff stuff animal. Casey's getting the cat. No, I can't get the cat. We'll show you what we got in the car.
start with the biggest, most obnoxious item that we got at Disney Outlets. We went to the one on Violin. I saw this in a bunch of vlogs and I showed Aubrey it and so she made sure that she saved and she literally had enough money to buy this ginormous stuffed animal. I don't know how to show how big he is. But I mean, he's tall. And he's normally $69.95 in the parks and she got him for $29.99. So we would have never paid $70 for a stuffed animal and I think it's ridiculous she paid 30, but you do you. So that's all that Aubrey got from the outlets. And then, yes. And then this is what Casey got. He got this monkey from Shanghai. This guy was $7.99. And then he got this hat that says Jedi in training. That was $4.99. And so these were, I would assume this is normally $20. And this is probably around that $21.95. Uh, from Disney Parks. Yeah, that was like usually 13. Trevor went in wanting a shirt, but then he saw this hat, and he's actually been asking for a drawstring bag like this for a really long time, and the fact that it was Oswald, and they had tons of Oswald stuff. Like, he was trying to get me to buy Oswald purses and stuff, but so he got this and this hat, and yeah, I want to say that's it. Usually those were 25 or 30, and they were five. Yeah, so really, really good deals there. And then for me, I grabbed these D-Tech headphones. I just think that they're cute. Uh, I'll use them at my desk. And these were $5.99, normally $27.95. And then I bought this shirt for me, uh, which says Walt Disney World, and it's very like Americana. And this is normally $39.99, and it's $7.99 in the parks. And this definitely has a weird fit. It fit fine around my stomach. Like it actually was a little bit loose, but it was definitely tight on my chest. And then it was very loose in the arms, which is normally opposite for me. Normally I have it tight in my chest and my arms, but not my belly. So that's probably why that was there. And then we grabbed these pencils. And I don't remember how much these ones were, but I figured these will be good to throw into client packages. They say Walt Disney World on them. But I can hold one. And then I also grabbed three of these. These are $2.99, and I want to say these are $11.99 in the parks. And anyone that buys Christmas party tickets for me will get one of these as a part of their goodie package. Uh, we love these things. I have a Halloween one. I have a mini one. I have a Cinderella, no, Magic Kingdom one, I think. I have a lot of these, and they're really durable, and they stay hooked on my stuff, and I just really, really like them. We also found these, which were $5 when we went to the parks in July and September of last year, and we got them for a dollar. So again, I grabbed these for client gifts. I figured these would be really good for little boy gifts. I have no problem finding things for little girls, but it's kind of harder to find things for little boys. And then I also got these coloring books, which I get every time we go because these are just a really good value for little kids. For clients, I send them out and it's a really good quality coloring book and these are $1.99 you know wherever you go um, and I just think that that's a really good thing to send to clients and then we also got these pins which will go to either client gifts or they will go to my kids when we trade pins over the next trip that we go on so we only found one of these stormtroopers and this was $2.99 and it's normally silver and I assume silver is I want to say it's one of those ones that's like $9.99 we also grabbed a two of the heart minis right there. And these ones are just Disney Parks ones and these are $3.99, again, silver. And then we found three of the grand opening of Shanghai. And I think actually Trevor got one of these in his stuff to save on his pin board. And we obviously don't know how much it is because it's all in, you know, the, the writing for Shanghai. But this one was $2.99, so we'll probably keep one and then pin trade the others. And then we met up with friends while we were there and she gave me some stuff that uh, she had purchased for me a long time ago. One of it being this stitch shirt that Aubrey tried on so I can't even show you. Yeah. But all of these items were, I believe, $41. Uh, we also got this light up aerial set for Eliana uh, and it had a few pieces to that. I also grabbed this wallet from Captain America that is $5.99, normally $19.95 that I will probably put in a stocking. 
here is the stitch shirt. I don't know how much it is because she took the tag off of it, but my friend that went with us got the same shirt so her and Aubrey can be twins when we go on vacation together because like apparently all we do is vacation with them now. Um, I grabbed these for client gifts. These are $1.99, again, silver. Um, I grabbed this one, which was $2.99. This one, which is $2.99. And again, these will be for our kids to trade, are for um, $1.99, $1.99. Same one, $2.99, 2 dollars $2.99, $1.99, $1.99, $1.99. Then there's this one, which is $3.99, and this one might actually go to Casey, I think. This is normally $14.99 in the parks. $1.99. Yeah, I think I got these each for the boys to pen trade. Um, but yeah, so we'll use these either for pen trading or, you know, I'll throw them in with client gifts because I like to give my clients lanyards. So that's everything I believe that we got from the outlets. I could be missing something. 